I also noticed that you all have things projecting for youth empowerment and for, and for elderly abuse and Absolutely. so on. Tell us about that and survivors of, of, of some of the tragedies on both sides. I'm glad that you use that term survivors because we are about creating survivors. Victims come to us, but we want to turn their story into something victorious. They are able to overcome and really stand and share with others from their experience. So we've been reaching out to a number of communities that may be impacted by various levels of, of criminal activity. Some communities such as Sealots. Last week, our team would have gone into Sealots. We would have been familiar with what recently took place there. And we try to adopt communities that may experience this depth of crisis and not believe that a government agency would reach out to them because of stereotypes. And we go in and we walk through the community and connect with the humanness of their experience. Because in spite of what features may be projected, there is still the hurt. There is still a mother that would have lost a child. There is still someone that has to face a funeral home and watch their child in a box and still go on. So we recognize the humanness and the individuality of each story and we treat them as such. And also elder abuse is, is one of the, the unspoken issues of, of family violence that we see happening. And that's why we continue to champion that cause. We'd have started last year and we will continue this year going out to different communities. And we try to use also, apart from our, our trauma experience, we use a, a evidence-based approach. So based on the data, the areas that have high levels of elder abuse, we would craft an initiative in that area. So those are just two of the different um, initiatives that we're having coming up. And also we're looking this year how we could impact, how we could take this service closer to the individual, go out into communities a lot more, as much as our resources would allow, of course.